we should be living lives of service to other people. And she was, uh, she completely exemplified that. In the wake of Queen Elizabeth II's passing, Calgarians are paying respect and reflecting on the monarch's impact. At McDougall Center, a condolence book provides a place for thought. I think she's kind of the last link to the old world and that's broken now. I wanted to, them to remember that the Queen, our Queen, uh, lived a life of service, uh, selfless service to um, the people of Great Britain, of course, but to everybody in the Commonwealth. For Airdrie resident Phil Goldsney, family ties and sacrifice played a big role in his decision to sign. My father and my uncle, you know, fought under uh, for king and country back in the in the day and we're both wounded in the second world war so just a real tie to the monarchy and to the royal family and the queen condolences are also being collected online via the alberta government but for phil it was important to put pen to paper i just thought no you know i've never done this before but i'd like to just sign for my wife and i that uh, we recognize it that it's a solemn time all flags at City of Calgary and partner facilities will remain at half mass during a 10 day period of mourning. An additional condolence book will be available for signing at City Hall as of September 12th. In Calgary, Tate Lake Craft, City News.